The man who claims he is Jesus Christ. Only his name is Moses. Moses Tongwane. But he says, like his namesake, he has spent years in the wilderness and has been resurrected as the Son of God. No, I will never die as God gave me as a command. Shongwane's beliefs are already attracting a following. One of his disciples is 84-year-old Paul Subia. He says he and many of those living in the compound are on government grants. Sibia gives his entire monthly pension to Tlongwane. I'm a pensioner, however, I don't use it to support my wife, but I give it to the King of Kings as a financial boost. Sibia has abandoned his wife of 41 years to move into the compound. Alfin Sibia says she is now destitute and lonely. We were happily married all these years, but my husband decided to dump me for his religious convictions. When I asked him why, he told me it was the sacrifice he needed to make for his soul. Another of the disciples is 14-year-old Mfithaga Lombata. She dropped out of school in grade 6 and is now tasked with recruiting other pupils. Like all of Tlongwana's followers, she is convinced he is the Son of God. The disciples say their mission is to get the whole world to acknowledge Tlongwane as the legitimate Jesus Christ. News that moves. ENCA.com.